What is it guys, Snap Worker here. And today we are playing Generation Zero. It has been a long time since I've done a video. I know. Not gonna lie, be kinda slack. Also been doing a lot of stuff. And I picked up a couple new games, Boxing Day sales, plus a new headset, so mic should be a lot better now. The headset is a Turtle Beach Recon 70. And Generation Zero is a new game. The other, two, the other new games I got was Rage 2, Control, and Wreckfest, which I will be doing videos on as well. But other than that, let's get in. And Happy New Year's, everyone. Alright, let's see what shall we play as. Let's see. Oh. Let's go with military. There we go, that one. Yeah, it's all good. I've already played this. I've been playing quite a bit of it actually. And I have also finished Rage 2. I like this game, despite a bit of hate it has. Same for Rage 2. They're both amazing games, honestly. I don't understand with what people are saying about Rage 2. I hear a lot about the wasteland is very empty. Now take note, I have not updated any of these games. In Rage 2, the wasteland is not actually empty. There's quite a bit there. Sometimes there's actually a lot of stuff and might get a bit of lag. Some classmates. I skipped this part when I first put, when I started playing this. My control is kind of busted, so it just moves on, on its own. I'm not even. So I gotta like slightly tap. I don't know what's wrong with it. I've dropped it a couple of times on accident, obviously. Hang on. I'm gonna switch to the other controller. Hmm. That appears to work. Perfectly fine. I guess we're using this controller then. Sorry for that little jump cut there. Because when I switched controllers, I didn't know if um, the video stopped recording afterwards. So I had to check it. And it was. So, yeah. Sorry about that jump cut. Yeah, might as well take it all. Why not? I have music turned off, obviously, for reasons. I don't know if any of the music... We'll just take one of those. Because I don't know if any of the music in the game is copyright. But just to be on the safe side, I'll turn it off. I 
I don't remember why people are kind of hating this game. I quite like it. It's it's a bit of a game. Of, it's a game I've kind of been looking for for a while. Oh, we're just sitting there. I mean, I've counted some weird bullshit in this game. Right, so another video that's on its way, actually. A bit of Generation Zero bullshittery. No, I mean, I can see why people are kind of annoyed of this game. There is some things that I guess that really need some patching. What the fuck? That all just goes dark. Cause um, sometimes when you get a, a mission item before you even start that mission, the mission will tell you go to like collect those items, but you've already collected them, so like you've got to reload the game. The item that you collected won't be there. Like you won't be able to see it, but you can still grab it. It's a stupid weird ass glitch. But maybe in the next, hopefully in the next video, these games will be updated. Don't ask me why it takes a while. So saying I should go up here. Does it want me to jump out? Oh, true, that's right. It wants me to look over. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> I've only been playing this for like three days and I've forgotten what happened. I'm going to search down in a minute. That's another thing that's in this game when you try to. Some of these um, things that you can walk in these little shack things, sometimes you actually have to jump in because of how leveled up that is. That's another thing I've noticed in the game. A lot of the cars do that. Take note, never remove those adrenaline shots from your inventory. They save your life, literally. Because at first, I thought um, they were only usable in multiplayer. But until I had something in my inventory and I died and I could revive myself, I was like, oh, I thought these could only be used in co-op. I didn't know you could use them on yourselves. I was like, that's good, that's good. Do not be an idiot like me and remove it from the inventory. <laughs> you will regret it when you come to your death. Games are alright. Since you've um, got a bit of stuff in your inventory now, go waste it. Oh, yeah, and these little, these little shacks here, I found out that you cannot open these. 
So hopefully that's in an update. Because I'm sitting there going, oh, my game's bugged or you cannot open this, but you can't. They're just things you can't open. <laughs> about this game is that make sure you read these mission items because you're probably going to get lost at some points like I did it's just a little bit of um I'm going to just call this game Gen Z for short a little bit of Gen Z survival tips for you ok hold on hold on best hiding spot but let's go in inventory and sign that to a slot. one thing I didn't know at first that you could like select these and then go down I was always taking all and then go in my inventory and then dropping it it's another thing if you haven't realized which you probably actually have realized this is a really good game though I love it Still waiting for um, the forest to come out on disc for PlayStation, because that's only on the PlayStation Store. Oh, there you are! I didn't see you the entire time. Stock up on fireworks and flares, trust me, it'll help you in the long run, so you don't have to sit there trying to run around and kill them. I wasn't doing that at first, I was like, I ain't going to use these distraction items, they're going to be useless for me. I use them once, my I'm never not using these again. Some. There's so much handy, so they don't do the work. Health, wasting health packs. Using flares or oh, I didn't want that ammo. I don't have use for that ammo. I think there's oh yeah, there is. I think yeah, we'll need that because I believe we eventually get a um. It's not too long until we get a rifle, I believe. Oh, this controller kind of does it too. See how that moves by itself? I need new controls. <laughs> I mean, at least this one's not. Because that other controller was using. That was my good controller. I think I might have to take it apart and. It's just the analog sticks that are. The things that are fucked up. 
Cause I'll be playing a game and I haven't touched him. And then my like viewpoint will start slowly moving, or maybe something else might start moving slowly. It's never that. It's only the map that will start moving slowly. Like it'll do that. I was like, is it just a game? Is it my actual controller? So I went through, tested a bunch of games, and it was a controller. to flare because I thought this wheelbarrow was an enemy. Oh, that wasn't a flare, that was a firework. Damn. There's a flare. Those bobby pins. You don't find use for them until like later on in the game. You start getting some more skill points. Yeah, that's a rifle we get, or a baton. Even though it's not even called that in the inventory. It's like called s rifle. <laughs> Got it, it was a shot, uh, a rifle. There's a different mission. Oh well. Oh, she got a skill point now. Yeah. Uh, carry capacity. Lock picking right there. Yeah, yeah. Zero skill points earned. Thank you. So.
Yeah, let's go to the hunter's cabin. Yeah, now they're here. Oh, that's a javelin shot. Single bullet left. Okay, so we are looking for the hunter's cabin. The hunter. What is that? I think it was this way. Yeah, it was. Why is there just a black box above my name? <laughs> above play, I meant. So kind of sad. You can't open these. So everywhere I look around the door, it's just nothing. Oh well. this way I know it is I've already been here ah oh, that's it I believe it is kind of flare out so we're ready Very nice and detailed environment. There's a lot, a lot of foliage in that. Okay, never mind. That's not the right one. That's just a, a wharf. Which was it again? I honestly don't remember. Was it? Maybe. I don't remember. We'll find it. <laughs> or maybe th that's it. That's it, right there. Okay, no. <laughs> okay, we got the wrong one. Okay, we can fast travel there. We'll do that after. I don't know if there's. I don't think there was. Uh, there's no enemies over here. Nice one. Okay. Don't think there's anything we can loot here. Doesn't look like. No. Nothing. A little fast travel here.
Oh, it's just a bush. <laughs> I was like, oh, there's an enemy over there. <laughs> nah, it's just a bush. It's just a little bit of plants that are hovering in the sky. It's nice. I like Avalanche's uh, weathering system, it's nice. I like the guard race. I mean, this game is a lot more fun than Just Cause 4. Speaking of Just Cause 4, I don't know when the next part's coming. It'll, it'll come, maybe. I don't know. Same thing in Red Dead Redemption 2, part 2. Don't know when that's coming. Probably won't, honestly. That Red Dead 2 is a very long game. That's about a week that a game took for me to complete. Like, basically, non stop playing it. Don't even get me started on Witcher 3 either. I won't be doing a gameplay on that. That was a very long game. One game I can promise you that I will definitely finish a series on is Cyberpunk 2077 when that comes out. I pre order that. But I'll be finishing that game before I start any videos on it. Wait a little bit before I start my video series on Cyberpunk. Yeah, so I'll, I'll finish that game before I do a YouTube series on it, or I'll just play quite a bit of it and then start my YouTube series on that. So it might be a week before I even get to it though. Same thing with The Last of Us Part 2, if I end up pre ordering that, which I think I will. Look at this. These lootable crates are in the this clipping through objects. Or just any game in general I get I end up playing a bit of or end up finishing it before I start making any videos on them. It's just a little thing to know about what I do. Because I like to sit there and enjoy it peacefully, and then go ahead and start sharing my gameplay. There, there's a the rifle. design this house is stupid as I would not have this door opening that way or this door no actually this door I would have opened this way but this door I would have open in this way you get a scope uh, help with shooting long distances Health pack, first aid, whatever you want to call it. I think yeah, we're just in the 
high right now because I saw the little uh, icon indication thing. There's nothing in there. Such a little bit of that. I think, yeah, we have searched that. Search that back. See, this is the thing I am shit at in this game is finding all the things to read. I'll end up finding what I can find, and I'm like, I swear that's all I can find. I can't find nothing more. We'll just leave it at that. We got our new gun. Time we head to. I think. Oh, hang on. Farm. Search for any useful supplies in and around the hunter's house. See, I did complete this mission somehow. So I must have managed to collect all the loot. Let's see, we've searched them too. There's nothing more to search in here. Nothing at the back here. There's nothing beyond here. That is part of the hunter's shack. House, what do you want to call it? There's nothing in there. I've already finished that. There's nothing in there. I've already looted this spot. There's nothing by the wharf. These don't count as lootable things. I mean, you know what I mean. Oh, no. Um, yeah, these don't count as the loot to the location. So the rest of the loot you can loot is in this house. At least it has to be. Let's see that. Let's see that. What I found is all I can find. And this is a magical little room that, that I cannot see. I have no clue. I really don't. I can find. Let's just go to the farm. Down the mission, I'll bet. Why are you telling me? Alright, so we are going over this way. They're already down. It's like one, sh one shot and they're down. Get all of them. Go 
Zelda. I think there's something out here. Like a truck or something over here, I believe. Okay, this place, and now we're gonna need this. Another clip. Hello, two objects I'm clipping. car over there we can check out. Okay, see, this control is doing as well. See, I'm not even touching the um, camera button. It's just looking. Camera is moving over by itself. I like to touch, touch, 
Okay, both these controllers are doing it. Anything over here to fuck? No, but there's a bunch of hovering bricks. Okay, well there's a the farm. Let's see the new um Those gloves. They're too small for my hands. They're ripping. Uh, no, my character's hand's clipping through them. What a shame. We'll just wear the ring then. Okay. Good. Now that I have these gloves that are, Oh my god, what the hell? I really need to update this game. Oh, it's even worse. Still have the pistol. Perfectly fine. Oh, oh cool, my camera's doing that weird thing. Stop. That flare. Another one somewhere. There he is. dealt with nothing in this shed well I completely run oh god oh the first aid kit That's how the door should be open like that. I mean, when you're sitting there washing hands and someone comes in, <laughs> maybe not, but other than that, it's, 
I reckon that's how it should open. Is it the same? Uh, that's fine. Wait, so you can, that's another thing I hate. It's, you get. There we go. Or sometimes when the first a kit is like placed up on top here, it's hard to get. So you gotta like kind of like jump up on obstacles and try to get it, and then try to figure out whereabouts the little where it gets highlighted. <laughs> to er, uh, it's human, human, but human, <laughs> human. That's what. thing is that some of these houses just copy and paste like you walk in the house like hey I swear I've seen this place before yeah that's right the previous house I just walked in there's a couple of little ups and downs in this game mostly it's it's a, it's a pretty good game is it's definitely one of the greatest games of 2019 I believe this came out this year maybe it was last year Alright, it's this year. Anyway. If it, is, if it is this year, which I believe it is, it is one of the good games of 2019. 2019 was not a great year. For games, especially. Movies? Yeah, it was... It was decent enough for movies, games, not re really. A lot of the games are pretty shit. There's a lot of let uh, downfalls, a lot of let downs in that. I remember seeing how happy. I remember seeing all the hype and excitement for Crackdown 3, and then that went silent, and everyone thought it was cancelled, and then it comes out, and everyone's like, what the fuck is this bullshit? There's not many memorable games this year, that's how horrible it was. The, the game I reckon would be game of the year for this year is like, um... Oh, how do you say it? It's like Psychedo, Psychia. I'm sure you know what the game I'm talking about. I'll put the game on this. It'll be on the screen what game I was talking about. That'd be a game of the year, in my opinion. Even Rage, even Rage 2, I would consider game of the year. Bit of people might disagree with me on that, but I think another reason why people hate that game is just because Bethesda published it, and we all know what's been going on with Bethesda lately. Not good. Hopefully they pick up once they release Starfield, and that will increase the chances of them releasing Elder Scrolls 6. I would really want to see Elder Scrolls 6. Now, I'm, I've not lost complete faith in Bethesda. I, I, I have hope for them. I really do. I'm keeping my faith in Bethesda. Hopefully, they deliver a good game of Starfield. And it has taken them a bit, so I, I reckon it should be good. Though I do have a feeling that it might not be. Speaking of flops, I I do have a pretty big fear that Cyberpunk may flop. But how long it's been in production for and now it's coming and it's in and it's it's in its final development stage. I think we should be safe. It's in the hands of a very good company, C Project Red. So, 
should be all good. We see pretty red. They're making a promising game. Could be yeah, we did far. Okay. I think that should do it for today. I hope y'all enjoyed. Part two will be coming shortly. I can promise you that one. I feel like we're going to do quite a bit with Generation Zero. I feel like this is a much easier game I can make a series on. What the fuck is up with my hand? Why is it so <laughs> jagged? Anyway, despite uh, bits and pieces of bullshittery this game has shown so far, <laughs> speaking of that, <laughs> this game is a perfectly fine game. I like it. I wouldn't say game of the year, but I'd say it's a decent game for this year, though. See you in the next one. Peace out.